Hey everyone, so I'm going to be doing the Would You Rather beauty tag and it's been going around for quite some time now and I've enjoyed looking at everyone's responses but I never planned to do it but then Kayla Star tagged me so I guess I better do it now. Would you rather go out with messy hair and nice makeup or nice hair and no makeup? I would definitely rather go out with messy hair and nice makeup. I have gone out once before with absolutely no makeup on and I had three people ask me if I was sick or not feeling good or tired and I don't know I think I was feeling good that morning so I decided to not put makeup on and then two of my friends asked me if I was feeling okay and one girl was like oh you look really sick are you okay and then my boyfriend at the time his mom asked me if I was alright so that was a big blow to my confidence <laughs> as I thought I'd look fine going out with no makeup on, but apparently I don't look good. <laughs> I have really dark circles under my eyes, which you can probably kind of see now even. It's even hard to hide it with makeup, so without makeup, you know, it does look really bad. So, no, I'm not going out of the house without makeup or everyone thinks I'm sick. Would you rather shave your eyebrows or have your eyelashes fall out? I would rather have my eyelashes fall out <laughs> because then I can wear false eyelashes. I've only worn them once before, I didn't really like it, but I think those are easier to look more natural than if you're like painting on your eyebrows because, I don't know, that doesn't look natural. And considering how I am with eyeliner, kind of wobbly, my eyebrows would also look really bad. <laughs> would you rather be forced to shop only at MAC or Sephora for the rest of your life? Definitely no brainer, shop only at Sephora. I've only have one or had one MAC product, it was a concealer and it was fine, it wasn't amazing for the price, so I didn't buy it again. <laughs> and I've only been to Sephora twice, but there is no Sephora in my city. Whereas there is a Mac store, but no, <laughs> I don't go there. Would you rather wear the lip gloss lip liner look or 80s perm? Definitely the 80s perm, because with when you choose to put on the lip gloss lip liner look, then, I don't know, when people see you, basically they know that something's up, whereas the hair, they don't know, maybe that is the kind of hair I was born with, like, and actually I do have kind of frizzy hair, not that, like, 80s perm frizzy, but, you know, they shouldn't be judging me if I have that. Would you rather leave the house with an obvious foundation line or an overdone blush? Mm, if I can't hide it or blend it in or anything, then probably the overdone blush. Maybe people just think I went for a run or something. I have really rosy cheeks. Would you rather wear MC Hammer pants or biker shorts in public? Biker shorts. I I can look like I went to the gym or going to the gym or out for a run. I mean, when I used to go running, I think last summer I did for two months during the summer, like the hottest months. I don't know why I decided then I decided to run 10 kilometers three, three to four times a week and yeah, I was wearing biker shorts. I mean, I changed into them right before I ran and then I was so sweaty. I had a shower and changed out of them, but, you know, I wore them out in public, so if I was going shopping, I wouldn't want to, but I'd rather wear the biker shorts than MC Hammer pants. Would you rather have a bad orangey spray tan or really weird tan lines that can't be covered? I'd do the tan lines that can't be covered. People can think I was somewhere warm and I fell asleep in the sun with a strange tan line. <sighs> have a bad haircut or a bad hair color? Now, everyone, or almost everyone I've seen, would rather have a bad hair color because they're all like, it's easy to fix. And okay, that is true, it's easy to fix, but I thought the whole point of this is like, it's not which one would you have and then the next day you can fix it. It's like, if you have to live with it for a long time. So if it was just have it once and then I can fix it the next day. Yes, I would choose like everyone else with a bad hair color because then the next day I can dye it a normal color. But if it was something that I had to go for like months and months with my hair green, then I'd rather have a bad haircut. As long as it's not like this short and like all over the place, but if it's still kind of like shoulder length and even if it looks awful, there's like big blotches where I don't have hair, <laughs> I'd still rather have the bad haircut because you can just pull it back in a ponytail and it's a lot less noticeable than if you have bright lime green hair. You can't really hide that unless you wear
like a hat all the time. Would you rather have YouTube or Twitter taken away forever? Obviously Twitter taken away. I'm not on Twitter. I created an account when it like became big to see what it's all about. No, I don't particularly like Twitter for me. I don't know. Would you rather give up using makeup brushes or mascara? I'd say makeup brushes. I don't use too many makeup brushes as it is and I can get by with my fingers. Would you rather walk around all day with a skirt tucked into your underwear or be seen wearing a really see-through dress? Um, it wouldn't look good for everyone who has to see me, but I'd rather wear a really see-through dress. Well again, it's one of those things, if my, un my skirt is tucked into my underwear, as soon as I notice, I can pull it down and I'll be normal again. Whereas see-through dress I'll have to wear for however long I'm wearing it. But if it's something you know, even if I know I can't pull my skirt down, I have to walk around wearing it, then no, I'd do the seats or dress. Would you rather go to a party and not realize to the end of the night that you have lipstick on your teeth or that your eyelashes are coming unglued? I'd rather have lipstick on my teeth because then if someone is just looking at me and not talking to me, or they can be talking but I'll just be listening, then just looking at my face, you wouldn't see anything wrong with me. You wouldn't see like, if I have something there. But if my eyelash is falling out, then it's pretty noticeable if you're just looking at me. So definitely, I'll have lipstick on my teeth. Would you rather forget to put mascara on one eye or blush on one side of your face? I'd rather forget to put, well, I was going to say I'd rather forget to put mascara on because I kind of have my bangs covering this eye anyway. So if it's this eye, then that's fine. But, now that I'm thinking about it, I don't usually have that much blush anyways. I wear bronzer, and then I have like a little bit of blush just to the apples, but the majority of it is bronzer. So, you, I don't think it would be that noticeable if I didn't wear blush on one side. But if I went like blush and bronzer on one side and nothing on the other side, then that's noticeable. So, I'd rather wear just one eye mascara. Wear lipstick lip liner combo or frosty blue eyeshadow? Frosty blue eyeshadow. I remember when I was in grade 10, maybe? I rocked that look. Well, I didn't rock it, but I had it. And I wore it. So, oh well, I wore it back then. Like, so I can do it again. Would you rather wear foundation that is two shades too light or go overboard on bronzer? Depending what the season is. If it's the summer, then I'll go overboard on bronzer. But if it's winter, then everyone looks pale, myself included, unless you live in some nice warm place, but I don't. <laughs> so if you have overdone bronzer in the winter, then it just definitely looks out of place. So if it was summer, I'd rather have the bronzer. If it was winter, I'd rather have um, pale foundation. Would you rather drink an entire bottle of ketchup or run into a guy who broke your heart on a bad hair day when your face is breaking out. i definitely rather run into the guy. A whole bottle of ketchup? That is so disgusting. And I mean at the time I'm sure it would be a big deal. Oh my god I ran into him and blah blah blah. But I'm in a great relationship now. I don't really care what it looks like. Would you rather be able to date any celebrity you wanted or wake up every day with perfect red carpet hair? I would rather wake up with celebrity perfect hair every morning because my hair is like frizzy and curly, wavy, so if it was just like straight or then like nice curls every time I woke up, I'd be pretty good. <laughs> and the last one. Okay. Would you rather have your armpit smell musky or musky? or smell like lasagna? <laughs> it's such a strange question, but I definitely rather smell like lasagna because if they smell musky then it's just like you don't bathe yourself or wash yourself but if they smell like lasagna then people can just think I just had lasagna for breakfast, lunch, or dinner. <laughs> so there we go. <laughs> Those are my would you rather answers. <laughs> kind of weird, kind of funny. And who do I want to tag? I want to tag any uh, all of my subscribers and anyone else who's just watching this and then the one specific person I'm gonna tag is Sarah Louise XOX Kissable Beauty XOX so I look forward to seeing all of your videos and leave them as a response to this one thanks for watching bye